Hello, today I'm just going to show you some stretches that you can do at your desk. These stretches are great to help with any tension or stress that's building up <clears throat> from having to be bent over your laptop or your, your computer all day. So first of all, we're just going to do some finger stretches. So all I want you to do is just open out your fingers and just stretch and hold for a few seconds. So as you're kind of opening the hands out wide. So you might do this 10 or 15 times just to really open out and stretch the fingers. And also put them together, squeeze them out to release out the fingers. Nice good stretch. So again, you're looking to do this 10 or 15 times. Try and relax your breathing, breathe nice and Controlled, exhaling, relaxing into the stretch. So now we're going to just do some wrist releases. So just circles with your wrists. Again, loosen out the, the joints. Okay, so again, you might go 10 circles in each direction. Now we're going to do some flexor and extensor stretches. So this is whereby we're just going to get our wrist to stretch out this upper part of the arm. Again, keeping the shoulders nice and relaxed, tucked down, and just breathe into the stretch. You want to hold the stretch for about 15 to 20 seconds or so. Turn it over. Make sure with this stretch that you, again, Get the, all the fingers, so hold your thumb back along with all your fingers, keeping the shoulder tucked back and down. So again, we're stretching the underside of the arm. And again, it's important here to hold the stretch for again 15, 20 seconds. You might feel some tension releasing down through the lower part of the arm. And then we repeat on the other side. Okay, and keeping the elbow locked out. And we change over. Okay, making sure to get the thumb and all the fingers. Lock out the elbow, keep the shoulder tucked back and down, and just again relax into the stretch. So again, holding that for 20 30 seconds, depending on how very tight you feel your arm is. Okay, good. I also do these guys. Little prayer stretches. Okay, very good. And then we'll just do some tricep and lat stretches. So this is where you take your hand, put it behind you. You can hold on to your elbow and just give a little stretch so you feel a good stretch coming down through the tricep and onto the, onto the lat. Again, all of these stretches you want to hold for about 30 seconds depending on how tight you feel. And then we change sides again. Again, put a little bit of overpressure with the opposite hand. So you feel a good stretch coming all the way down through here. Again, it's good just to help release out the lats with this stretch. The lats will be in a shortened position or stretched over our computers. Again, relaxing into your stretch. Then we have our shoulder stretch. So just going to bring the shoulder across. And you get that shoulder blade to come wrap around. Keep the shoulder tucked back, don't have it up around your ear. Just keep the shoulder blade tucked back down and a nice stretch across the body. And change, exhaling, relaxing into the stretch. Okay, good. Then we can take our hands, join them behind our chair and stretch out our pecs. Nice good chest stretch. Relaxing into that again, hold it for 30 seconds. Concentrate on your breathing. Lovely. Roll out our shoulders. You might go 10 in one direction, 10 in the other. Lovely. 
And then the last is reach and stretch for the shoulders. So interlink your fingers, breathe in, flip them over, exhale up high, just above the head, breathe in and reach, and exhale out. Lovely, do that five times. So breathe in, exhale up, breathe in, reach, and exhale out. One more, breathe in, reach up, exhale, breathe in, reach, and exhale out. Two more, flip over, breathe in, exhale out, breathe in, reach, and exhale out. And one more, breathe in, exhale up, Breathe in, reach, and exhale out. Excellent, lovely. So now just some neck stretches, okay? So just nice, simple neck rolls. Okay. Try to open up, keep the spinal spine moving. We go five in one direction and five in the other. Okay. Some simple rotations left and right. Up and down. Obviously very good to help release the tension in the neck. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take our le left hand, we're going to sit on it, side bend our head, get the other hand a bit of an over pressure and pull it over to the side. So you're sitting up nice and tall, so you're getting a good stretch down through the upper trap into that shoulder. You're sitting on the opposite hand so as to prevent that shoulder coming up when we've got the overpressure pulling through on the neck. So again, nice 20, 30 second hold on that guy. Then you're gonna turn your head slightly like you're looking at your armpit, hand at the back of the head, and then another bit of overpressure pulling down. So this helps stretch the levator scapula, the muscle that goes from the back of the neck to the shoulder blade, which again will be under a lot of tension when we're Punched over our desk with our chins forward, staring at our screens. Get a nice relaxed hold, breathing as you go, into your nose and out to your mouth. Excellent. Let's change, swap hands, side bend, away from the hand you're sitting on, bit of overpressure with the arm, and relax into that stretch, very good. And turn to look at your armpit and a nice bit of over pressure through there. You might even feel this going all the way down the back if you're very, very tight. Very good. And a nice man is just hands behind the head and just a nice stretch. Don't have to pull your head off, but just relax into it. Feel the stretch going right down the small of the back. Very good, very good. Okay, so our last stretch then for the seated position would be just to simply turn away and you can hold on to the chair and just really try and stretch the lower back or you might use your desk if you're close to your desk. And again, just rotating through, leaning with your shoulders. Don't hurt the neck, don't overstretch the neck. You're really trying to get your thoracic spine to twist away through your shoulders and then return the other way. And again, hold in both of those positions for 15, 20 seconds or more. Make it a little bit stronger, cross your legs. And then some nice diaphragmatic breathing is a good thing to practice if you're under a bit of pressure, had, a, had, had a, a bad meeting. What you're looking to do is really just use your diaphragm to breathe. So if you take your le le left hand, place it on your chest, other hand goes on your tummy, and I want you to breathe into your nose, but I want you to fill your belly with air. 
So breathing in deep through your nose. And get this hand on your tummy, should move or expand as the tummy expands. So we're not chest breathing, so we're not trying to make sure that the, that the hand on the chest doesn't move. And as you exhale, really empty out the lungs. The exhale should be longer, two or three times longer than the inhale. Really concentrate on the hand on the tummy. Okay, so that's a simple little 10 minute video on some upper body stretches for when you're sitting at your desk feeling a lot of tension or if you're under a lot of stress and work. If you'd like to, to learn more, why don't you check out my website at rangeofmotionphysicaltherapy.ie. Thank you. Bye-bye.